Hi, this is Allie from Crafty Crafters. I'm here to do a little share. I did two swaps with my friend Cassidy, and I'm going to share what I did. We did a bow, a bow swap. So these are the bows that she gave me. Very cute. I love them all. And it was, you swap 10 bows for 10 bows. And I think I did like about 12 or 15, something like that, 20. I don't know, I just kept making bows and throwing them in her bag. Um, and it was to be able to put them in either your flip books or any kind of books or your photo album or whatever. So these are the cute bows she gave me, which I love, 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 love. But not only did she do that, she sent me some extra little goodies to go with it. As you can see, there's one, which I love. And some more. Oh, bias tape. I love bias tape. I cannot tell you how much I love bias tape. I love it. It feels good. It's nice. Everything all about it. It's nice. And it looks good on projects, too. That's what's cool. I got a few tags. And she sent me some cute little sayings for whatever. I can use that in flip books. I can use that in whatever I want. But not only did we do that, we did a junk journal together as a project. I had never done one, so I ended up doing... The very first one for her, but I also did another one for another group. It was a cake box one, and you saw those videos that I had put out previously. So this is what I got in return for my other journal. She took and she made a cute little thing to go around the middle. I love it. It's like elastic, and she put a clip on it and everything. It's really cute. There's that. And then she used the bias tape for a little fun stuff for on the outside. It just feels so good and looks good. So she decorated the envelope, and like I said, it was a 6 by 12 inch envelope probably longer I think I can't remember exactly 6 by 12 I think that's what it is though but you put little things and put sayings on there so it's decorated really cute and then you open it up and we'll just kind of go through the book I'm going to go kind of quick because I don't want it to be a long long video so tons of fun stuff she hand stamped stuff in here there's a cute doily she made a pocket oh and when we do these books I don't know if you remember we do signatures so you can see that she had done two signatures. See right there? And you can see the little end right here where it shows two. There's one, two, one, two. And she did a really good job of tying them off and not very noticeable. That's what I love about it. So and then here's the book, the inside. I'm going to go kind of quick like I said before. So here's an envelope. We're going th through the first signature. She did some stamping. Now I love stamps. Okay, well, I'll show you in a little bit. But you can't look at my craft room. You can't judge me. Okay, because my room's a mess. Always a mess. So here's a tag. And there's a pocket someone made. You can see right there. And she did some stenciling. As you can see, I love stenciling. There's the other half of the... No, this is a different po envelope. So I'll kind of... I'll point out when we get to the middle of the signature. The scrap of paper that she used was really nice, which I love. And here's a, like a book page paper. On the back, she put a tag in here. Of course, she is my favorite stuff that I love. Da -da 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 -da. There's a doily. And here's another little pocket with some tags and stuff in it. Some more stuff. And then she made this cute, she took and put a, like a lace across here. I made another pocket and put some stuff in there. And then she put this cute little guy here. Isn't that just incredible? I love it. I love it. So she kind of hit, tuck, just tuck little, little things here and there. That's what's cool about a junk journal. Is you make little pockets throughout it. And you tuck things in it. So you never know. You know, like this one. See, look at this cute little pocket here. Two little tags. Starting to place them. Ooh, I like that thing. And then back there, she has another little pocket. But in the pocket, she has a little paper bag. And inside the paper bag, she has another tag. Awesome. I love it. So keep going through, seeing stuff. Oh, and if you hear kids in the background, it's like about 6.30 in the morning. And I have daycare kids here. And they're trying to be quiet. I had to redo the video because the first time they were arguing and fighting in it. <laughs> it did not sound good. So, and they're brothers. So, just kind of let you know if you're screaming or yelling, don't worry. Here's more the envelope. There's another cute little thing. And look at how she did that. She took and she stained this like it was all one piece. So, it comes out. Isn't that kind of cool? That's so cool. I don't know what. She used paint. 
kind of looks like it could be paint or she used you know like coffee some of the stuff is coffee oh and then she has oh my gosh look at this oh my word an account book wow i wonder what year it is let's look see oh someone wrote in it oh my goodness 1913 someone's account book from way back in 1913 this is like a piece of treasure in my hand right now cassidy my husband is going to want to take this for me because he's going to go oh my goodness i need it i need it i need it because we love old antique stuff this is really cute thank you cassidy oh my gosh i love it that's the hidden treasure like i said junk journals to some people it's just whatever to other people it's a hidden treasure but it's in a pocket. That's what makes it really cool. I love it. Okay, and here's some more pages. I just kind of go through. I'm going to go kind of quick now, okay? Because it's getting late in the video. Pocket. Some more stuff. Another pocket. Tags. Oh, look at that dress. I know she made that. It's really cute. Another little thing. She paper clip something in there. There's something else. Cassie, this is a fantastic book. Oh my gosh, I just love it so much. Another thing, some more scenes. Just some cute little lace roll on this page. There's another little pocket with a bingo card in it. Another page. Here's another pocket with some more stuff in it. And we're in the second signature right now. Some more stenciling. Oh, and a pocket. Oh, and here is some. Look at that. Okay, now, this is one of my favorite papers. I can never remember. See, look at that cute background and everything. I can't remember if it's Graphic 45 or Graphic 49. Okay, my friend Lori, she just laughs at me because <laughs> I can never remember. She goes, Allie, it's such and such. So, from now on, I'm just going to call it Graphic 40 something because I can never remember if it's 45 or 49. But I love that paper. It's one of my most favorite papers. And it is the most expensive paper, but it is my favorite. There's some more lace. Some cute little... Oh, look at these. I love these coloring pages. Adult coloring pages. That looks like she photocopied it in thick paper. Or could have cut it out. Look. There's another little cute thing. There's some more. Oh, and a little envelope. Oh, look at that envelope. Seeds of love. And there's some sayings in there. I'll go through that later. But I love all that stuff. There's another... Oh, what she made? Some more stuff in there. See, it's just everything's tucked in here. Everywhere. It's all over it. Okay, here's this. And look, I want to show you something. This is where the center signature is. Take a look. See where the string goes through? She hid it in that little book there. It's pretty cool, huh? Paper clip. I love that paper clip of a bicycle. It's really cute. Some more pages and some more little things she paper clipped in. And she did a lot of um, inking and staining and um, just a lot of stenciling and everything. Okay, here's another page. I love all the stenciling and inking and everything. It's really cute. It's just some splattering here, it looks like. Sprays. I love my sprays. I did some of that in the morning of her. It's just so much fun. Look at this tag. Oh, it's so cute. Look at this little tag. So cute. Thing, some more little things. A little pocket with some stuff in it. And so that's that's the book. Wait. No, it's not all the book, actually. Look in here. Some more goodies. Oh, my goodness. Look at all these goodies. So many fun things. So, Cassidy, I just want to say thank you so much. For my book, for my junk journal, I love it, 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 love it. It is really the cutest thing. So I'm going to tell you something else. Okay, remember the stamps I told you about, how I love stamps? I had a friend a long time ago that was really struggling, and she needed me to help her with her daycare, help watch her kids. And I said, sure, and I gave her a deal. Didn't really think about it, because, you know, I always give people deals because I want to help out people, because people help me out all the time, too. So it's kind of like take care of one person, you they take care of you, and that's just how it is in life. That's how I've always done things, help people out, and they always help me out, and we just kind of build friendships on that. 
So this friend, she loves stamping. And I was just getting into it. I didn't have very many. So she was moving away. She was going to move to another spot because she got accepted at a nursing job. And she was so excited. And she had tons of stamps. So she came to me one day and said, Allie, I want you to have my stamps. So that's how I got started in, in collecting stamps. So I'm going to show you, but don't judge me by my craft room. It's really messy. Okay. So here's the stamps. She gave me this container. Look at that. Full of stamps. Just look at that. All of those. For free. And I've collected since then that container. <laughs> and there's a little container back there behind that red box. See right there behind that red box? Nether hole stand. But that's not all. Okay. Me and my stamp, I've gone wild. Here's some more stamps. I have all of Stephanie Bernard's in there, and this is a deep one. So that's kind of part of my stamp collection. I still have more in other hidden spots. But I love my stamps, and I just want to say thank you so much, Cassidy, for my book. I love it, and I look forward to our next swap. Bye. Oh, don't forget to subscribe and like me. Okay, bye.